So you can see here when I log in, you see it shows me these few different accounts that I can select from. Now, I just removed the Azure profile that we created earlier. So let's see what happens when I click refresh. I have no account now, right? You don't see anything. I put in my email address. I hit next. And so it's asking me for an account. So let's see what happens when we re-push the profile. So I've re-pushed the profile. So we'll take ourselves all the way back. Let me go to sign in. See how it sees the profiles again? So what's actually happening is the SSO extension profile is creating these Azure identities just like when you connect your machine from the Access Worker School account on your PC. And so I just thought it'd be good to kind of show you what it's actually doing because it's confusing, you know, if it's working. You can actually see it, my connected accounts right there and then.